During the trial, she said, I am very intelligent, and I was very devoted to my work in the camps. I struck at least two prisoners every day. Having made this statement, she was probably the only one to think so. Her execution was held publicly and became a theater of horror, which was recorded by official press photographers. The execution was planned in such a way that after each truck would be driven forward, the 11 convicts were left suspended and their bodies would not fall from too great a height. As a result, the nooses did not break their necks and did not cause an instant death. This short drop method of hanging resulted in a torturous death by strangulation of each of the criminals, lasting anywhere from 10 to 20 long minutes. When the last convict died, the security forces allowed the crowd to the gallows. People ripped off buttons, cut off pieces of fabric, and kicked and smashed the corpses.